Good afternoon, I'm Mike Powers. It was a bumpy morning for a number of balloons at the Fiesta. Brisk winds sent some of them crashing into power lines, light poles, and even a tree. News 13's Crystal Gutierrez is live at Balloon Fiesta Park with details on this. Crystal? That's right, Mike. We've heard reports of seven balloon crashes or hard landings so far this morning. Now, in one of the crashes, a passenger tumbled out of the basket after the balloon struck some power lines. His injuries were minor. When we arrived, the balloon was caught on the power lines and had to be cut down by PNM. It happened near Piedras and Turner. Witnesses say the balloon appeared to be out of control. And near San Mateo Montgomery, another balloon struck a different set of power lines. PM crews were still fighting the winds as they tried to free that balloon. And near Catherine in Louisiana, our crews arrived to find a balloon dangling from a light pole. And we're told the balloon struck the pole. It then ripped a hole through it, causing the balloon to become snarled. Fire crews had to use an extended ladder to free it. And near Candelaria in 12th, as the balloon attempted to land in a parking lot, a gust of wind blew it across the street. The basket slammed into a glass door, shattering it. We've also heard reports of a fifth balloon that took out power lines near and Broadway. There were no injuries reported at that scene. And two more balloon crashes reported near Pan American Freeway and Asuna in San Pedro and Cutler. Now here at Balloon Fiesta Park, as you can tell from the flags, the winds are pretty gusty. You could just imagine how gusty it was up there this morning. All right, Crystal, and I think a lot of us are wondering why even go up in the balloons this morning? Well, Mike, it just wasn't this windy out here. Balloon officials gave pilots the go-ahead to lift off this morning, and it wasn't until the balloons were out for some time that the winds picked up.